So, um, y'all, so I don't know if you guys remember, but in the last video I said that I was going to do a video comparing the two label makers that I showed in the video. So I showed the Dymo and then I also showed the Brother label maker. So these two, I had this one first and then I had this one second. I'm going to tell you, tell you guys which one, um, is better in my opinion and which one, um, is cheaper. So, yeah, I'm going to tell you guys which one is better. Like, I already know which one you guys should get, but I'll just need to wait to find out what that is. So, this one, um, this one's like 20 bucks. I think this one's like 20. Um, and then this one was like, this one was more expensive. It was like 35, 40. It costed more. Um, and then also ordering the tape separately. Like, I got the tape in bulk, but y'all, it's a little expensive. This is how this tape looks right here um they both are battery operated so that's how it is inside um this one was very very confusing to figure out this one's very very self-explanatory to figure out um this one wastes a lot of tape this one wastes some tape but not as much as this one this one has costed me a lot of tape wastage though i will say that i had this one first i'm going to show you guys how this one prints out and how this one prints out these are both um white tapes with black ink on it it's supposed to be and i'm going to show you guys which one is which so i'm, I'm just going to show you guys two different things and then you guys can guess which one did what okay so hold on <laughs> I'm going to show, you know what, actually I should give you guys a better example. I was going to show you guys this, which is one of them, but I want to show you guys like an example of these like by each other. Um, so let's me see, where am I going to go? Where am I going to go? Here, I'll do this one and I need another one that's like the other printer. We'll do this. All right, guys, so I have two different ones and they both are labeled. I'm going to tell you guys which label maker did what. So these are both sunglasses products. I'm going to show you guys the sunglasses in here while I'm at it. So these are our Victorians, which are my favorite sunglasses on the website, y'all. They're freaking cute as heck. Like, just look at them. I'm obsessed with these. I'm going to put them on so y'all can see how they look on. Um, so this is how the Victorians look on. They're so cute, y'all, and I can't wait for you guys to see the purse that comes with them. But yes, um, I mean, not comes with them, but it like corresponds. Like they're pretty much a set, but they're not a set, if that makes sense. So this is the Victorian, and this is how the label on it looks. What did I just say, guys? They're both white, um, white labels. They're both supposed to be like this, technically. They're both supposed to be like that. Um, so one of them did this, and literally all of my labels look like this because of that one printer. And then one of them did this. So this is the other one. This one says France. And these are um, some kids' sunglasses right here. Let me show you guys these. I'm not going to put these on because, y'all, they're, like, way too small for my face. But this is the kids' one. Super cute. And they're the France glasses. So as you guys can see the difference, I'm going to put it, like, on top of each other so y'all can see. This is how it is. And now let me tell you guys which one did what. So this one was done by, drumroll, Dymo, Dymo did his job, y'all. It worked. It worked how it was supposed to work. And then we have Mr. Brother over here doing stuff like this. And it costed me more. The tape costed more, and it already wastes a lot of tape as is. This technically was supposed to be like wasted tape, um, but I was like, I, I have to use this tape, so I just ended up using the dark ones, um, even though it was not supposed to be like that. They were supposed to come out uh like this literally like this and if you guys are wondering why this says neck two this is just it just means necklace number two because i number my jewelry so that like when it's time to package up we know like what is what so yeah it's just a lot easier so i'm gonna go ahead and put this one back but yes you guys got to see the difference like between them so obviously you guys know which one is better the dymo is um better in my opinion just because the brother, it, it like y'all, it literally costed me more. Like I'm, I'm just gonna show you guys. So look, this is how it is on. This says grape self defense, y'all. Let's just let's just press print. It's the same type of. It's supposed to be the same color printer. Uh, the same color paper. So here we are. You guys hear it printing? All right, so we just printed. And then let's uh, see what this one has on it. Let's see what this one has on it. Okay, this one says neck 19 because we were doing the necklaces. So let's go ahead and print this one. This is how this one looks. 
So let me show y'all up close. Y'all, ain't nothing, nothing's coming out. That's why we have to use the other one because this one ran out of paper. Oh yeah, let me say this too. This one runs out of paper so fast. Like, I don't know if the Dymo rolls are tiny, but y'all, it runs out way too fast. That's the one thing about this one. Like, you need to take every single second. Also, oh, let me mention this. This one also did, um, it was like cutting out some of the words um, on some of them. Like, it started like fading a little bit. And I don't know why it started doing that, but yeah. Um, and then let's see this one. This one, this is how it printed out, y'all. This is how this one printed out. This is the Brother Label Maker. And like I said, y'all, I wasted a lot of tape, bought extra, uh, bought extra tape, and it was all wasted, literally. Because this Label Maker does not work how it's supposed to work. And I was watching YouTube videos. A lot of people were saying the same thing, that their Brother Label Maker was just... It was not working. Um, and I get, I, I hear good things about this one. They also have a bigger version of this one. I stick with, I got the smaller one because I wasn't sure if I could trust another label maker. Like sometimes you think, oh, if I pay more for something, it's going to be better. But sometimes more is less. Sometimes more is less. Um, but yeah, so it turns out that the cheaper label maker turns out to be better. It worked better. It labeled like a lot of my jewelry thingies before it started doing that, um, <coughs> I can actually show you guys, actually. Anyways, I'm going to show y'all. So look, as you can see, it labeled a lot of these. Um, it labeled literally so many. Like, I wish you guys could see all of them. But yeah, this is it. I'm going to show you guys how I organized my jewelry in another video. Um, but this is an example of what it started doing. So it was printing like this, perfect, literally the entire time. And then it started doing this right here. You guys see that? Like it started like cutting the words out at top. Some of them were a little bit worse. So yeah, that was, it's just like y'all, honestly, it's really hard to find something good these days because like there's not a lot of reviews out there about certain things. Like I, when I go to buy something for my business, I want to see reviews. I want to see reviews on this and that, but I never see them. So <laughs> yeah, uh, but if you guys are looking for a good label maker, go with the Dymo. Um, I still trust the Dymo. Honestly, it could have been because of the way so the person that was using the Dymo, like they were, they actually labeled these. I didn't label them. It could have been the way that they were doing it. They could have done something wrong. So I can't blame the, blame the label maker. But as of like all the work that each one has done, the Dymo has done a lot more work and it works better to me. So yeah, um, definitely this one. Y'all, hold on, hold on. Let me get, let me get a thumbnail for my video. No, I'm just playing. <laughs> So yeah, these are the two. Which one is better? And yes, I will see you guys in the next video. Make sure you guys like, comment, subscribe. If you guys have any questions, um, definitely ask. I got y'all if you want to know like where to get it from. Um, oh, let me just tell you guys. So I got the Brother from eBay. I got the uh, Dymo from Amazon. But if you guys have any additional questions, definitely let me know down below. I do have an Amazon storefront if you guys want to check that out. I do business promotion if anybody wants their business promoted. Um, well, actually, no, I'm not going to say that just because like, y'all, my P.O. box is in a whole nother state. So yeah. Anyways, I'll see you guys next time. Bye.